Tanya Hessenshai's latest documentary, Drone, provides a disturbing glimpse into the CIA's use of remotely piloted aircraft. One of its allegations is that young gamers are being directly recruited to take control of craft, as they carry out missions throughout the world. In the modern era, the skills that players develop in military simulations are now a valuable military resource. How should we feel about that? And how should we feel about first-person shooters in general? Games such as Call of Duty and Battlefield sell in their millions, dominate the charts and present a very particular view of war and how it is fought. Fans call it escapist entertainment, but with warfare becoming ever more automated and game-like, how long can developers absolve themselves of socio-political responsibility? Is it still okay to play at being soldiers in games that barely register the complex realities of the conflicts they represent?